I'm Joshua Bardwell, and you're gonna learn something today. I have a small improvement to the way that you're doing something now that is gonna change your life. One weird trick to prevent your quadcopter from flipping out. Stay tuned. As you probably already know, there are a few things that can be wrong with your copter that cause it to flip out the minute you take off, like just Tasmanian devil whirlwind. And this is really a big deal because it can fly 50 feet in the wrong direction before you get your finger on the disarm switch and get it turned off. And that's why I recommend, especially with a new build, before you fly it, you set it way far away from you. You arm it and you raise the throttle slowly and you watch for signs that it's gonna flip out. But the problem is if you've screwed something up, it still flips out. And sometimes you didn't stand far enough away or whatever, bad news. Well, I've figured out a way to prevent that. So you can see the quadcopter in front of you right now has three red props and one blue prop, and that blue prop is the wrong direction. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna arm, and instead of raising the throttle, I'm just gonna bump the pitch and roll stick slightly. Now, if the quadcopter is working correctly, it will just tilt gently left, right, forward, back. But if anything is wrong, it will try to flip out. But it won't be able to because the throttle's all the way down. And that's why I feel confident doing this standing so close. I'm a little bit terrified. You see how it's not working right? That tells you that something is wrong, but it didn't flip out. It didn't go flying 50 feet in the other direction. If I were to have raised the throttle, it would have flipped out. And so, what I suggest you do, instead of that stand far, 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 far away and raise the throttle thing, you leave the throttle down and you just do what I did there. And if the copter does what it should do, if it tilts left or tilts right normally, you're probably good to fly. If not, then go check what's going on. In fact, it might not be a bad idea to do this anytime you change a prop because, hey, you could put the prop on wrong and there's nothing more embarrassing than being out with your friends and flying and your quadcopter flips out and they go, hey, dude, you got clockwise and counterclockwise props, right? Yeah, so maybe just give it a little bump before you fly anytime. There's your tip for the day. Uh, I feel like this is a very small, I don't think I oversold this in the beginning. This is a very small tip, a very simple thing to do, but how many people have broken a copter? I've seen pe pictures of people who got cut up because their copter flipped out and it cut them even though they were standing far away. Br broken property, broken copters, personal injury, and if you just do what I showed you in this video, all of that will be avoided. So, pass it on, teach it to your friends. I think it's a really good tip. Thanks for watching, happy flying.